What is going on everyone? Bitter Hyena here. It is Monday and I hope you are all doing very well. That being said, today is the start of the week that I'm going to attempt to upload a video every single day, at least Monday through Friday, possibly something on Saturday and Sunday. I'm not quite sure yet. I want to see how this first five days goes. But for today's video, we're going to crack open a Battle Styles booster box. Now here on the channel, I don't normally do English booster boxes like in a full video, I usually split them into three different parts because let's be serious here. We're all adults. We've got stuff to do. It's hard to sit down and watch like a whole 30 minute, 40 minute video. I know that more packs on YouTube's like the more you open in a video, the more views you get, blah, blah, blah. We ain't doing that. We're not ripping these packs open just to see what like expensive cards we can get. We are opening this set because we love to open up Pokemon cards here or basically any kind of cards, honestly. And we're already gonna have some little longer videos throughout the week anyway. So starting at today, we will be opening up one third of this box, so 12 packs. We will be doing the next 12 packs on Wednesday and then the final 12 packs rounding out the whole 36 pack booster box here on Friday. So then on Tuesday and Thursday, we will be opening up one of the new Japanese sets. Well, one on, you know, Tuesday, one on Thursday. So full week full of great freaking sets great pulls hopefully we can get some alter art cards up in here especially from battle styles here so let's go ahead and get into this and see how this will treat us so like i said 12 packs here we will i i don't know if i want to take them out randomly and eh, we'll do randomly i guess we can do that so let's see Take this, put it in the back here. There we go. Full little booster box set up there. All right, let's see what we can get here. Now I picked this booster box up from my buddy James over at Awesome Games. Y'all know him, I've talked about him many times before. If you would like to get your hands on some TCG product, link is in the description below. But let's get into this. First pack, I have not had too many crazy battle style hits. I've gotten some V's, some V Maxes, all that kind of jazz, but no like special arts. Uh, I don't think we've pulled any full arts either, gold cards or anything like that. So let's see what we can do. First pack, we've got one. I don't know why I'm counting it. We've got Single Strike Scroll, a Abyss Sharp. We've got Cubone, a Frillish. We've got a little Blip Bug, a Roly Coley. We got a Chimeco. A reverse XP share and on the end, starting off good with a Tabu Coco V. First pack magic, not too bad whatsoever. Very cool. And I just realized uh, the problem here is I am very bad at keeping track of stuff. So we've opened up one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Pull a couple together. Eight nine, 10, 11, and 12. There we go. There are our 12 packs. That way I can set this booster box off to the side and not try to sit here and remember what I've opened and what I haven't. And this plastic had some like, the Pokemon like symbols and all that all over it was like real powdery. I don't know why. I know, uh. I think it was Big Jiggly had the same problem. I don't know. Either way, let's get into this next pack here. All right. Let's see if we can do something good. Our full English booster boxes that I have opened up here on the channel normally haven't been too awful crazy. The base set sword and shield one I did open a quite a while back. Uh, it was pretty good. It was decent, but it wasn't anything too crazy here. I think we're focusing on XP share there. Put it off to the side a little bit more. We got a Shinx, a Gligar, we got Spoink, a Bronzor. We got that awesome Tetpig artwork. We got a Reverse Rare Luxray, very cool. And on the end, we got a Hollow Crobat. Two for two on hits, not bad. All right, next pack, pack number Trace. Let's see. Let's see if we can at least get maybe a full art in this this opening. That would be nice. 
or VMAX. I think the only VMAX I've pulled is for the single strike Urshifu. I can't remember if I have pulled any others other than that one. All right, next pack, we've got an Escape Rope, Tower of Waters, we got Luxio, a Remoraid, we got Spiro, a Pachirisu, we got Truby, a Minfu, and another Reverse Spiro there, and on the end, a non-hollow Victory Bell. Our first dud pack there. All right, Rapid Strike, Urshifu. What you got for us, bear? All right, here is your code. Good luck, one, two, and three. Energy, all right. I think we got something here, let's see. Got a Pig Knight, a Level Ball, we got more Pico, a Tepig, we got Bone Edge, and Electabuzz. We got a Baltoy, Gligar, a reverse Salazzle, which is another reverse rare, not bad. And on the end, we got a Hollow Embor, which looks awesome. Love the art to that one. That is very cool. Very nice. I don't have that one. I have been opening up some Battle Styles packs off camera with my son. And I gotta say, he's got some better luck with this set than I have thus far. He's pulled quite a few things. Very, very happy for him. It's awesome seeing kids actually getting some hits from packs. All right, next one, we've got Heatmore, a Tower of Darkness. We got Karina's Focus, a Bellsprout, Bronzor. We got a Murkrow, Horsey, and another Churubi, a Reverse Rapid Strike Scroll. Not bad, I haven't seen you yet. And on the end, we got a Victini V. There we go. I don't think, I can't remember if I pulled Victini V yet or not. Might be a new one, might not. He said, my memory of this set ain't very good. We haven't opened, well, uh, we've opened quite a bit, I should say. I've still got some collection boxes to get opened as well. The Urshifu and, well, the Urshifu boxes, I should say. All right, next pack. We've gotten a lot of water energies as well. All right, can we get a full art of her? That would be great. We got a Perugly, a Hunch Crow, Horsey, spitting out water everywhere. We got Mankey, Cute Galarian Slowpoke. We got a Formantis, awesome Remoraid artwork there. A Reverse Swoopa, and on the end, an on Hollow Aegislash. All right. We've got, what, one, two, three, six packs left. Already halfway through. All right. Next one up, Empoleon. Let's see what we can get here. All right. He said, I am hoping for at least one Alter Art or Hyper Rare or good Full Art Trainer. I'd be happy. I'll be happy. Let's see. I've seen a lot of people getting some crazy hits, like huge amounts of hits from these boxes so would be nice i do believe this is still a first print run box too so who knows a pawn yard we got a hound hour a reverse leaky leaky another reverse rare and a minshaw i forget how you say that freaking thing's name minshaw we're gonna go with that all right next pack let's see come on just some V hits so far. Definitely be saving some hits for the other parts of the box here. One, two, and three. This, these are like very, look at that. There's so much whiting on the edges of these. Definitely not going to be some PSA worthy cards pulled in this box. We got the Pokemon version of a, the, what is it? Apple Watch, yeah, Gold Bat. Glysaur, a Baltoy, we got a Gligar, cute little Yukimori Sandalit, we got a Bronzor, Cacnea, we got a Reverse Bruno, which is also full art in the set, I forgot, and a Pavilion on the end. Hitting a very big dry streak here. Normally that would suck, but we're still, we're still gonna get some pulls in this box. All right, there's that. One, two, and three. Energy. All right. 
Let's see here. We got a Durant. We got camping gear. A Hunch Crow. We got Bow Toy. A Galarian Mr. Mime. Another Fermantis. I feel like we've pulled Fermantis in just about every pack. We got Zubat. A Reverse Heat More. And on the end, a Lorantis. Non hollow. Jeez, man. Three packs left. Two V's so far in two hollows out of 12 packs. Come on, my man. Let's see, can we actually get a very decent hit in this box or this first part of the video? All right, Rapid Strike Scroll starting off with, we got a Bufalant, a Crawdont, Roly Coley, we got a Chai Mecco, we got awesome Onyx artwork, probably one of my favorites. We got a Yukimori, Salizipede, Gulameow, we got a fan of waves, and on the end, a non hollow Conkeldur. Conkeldur is what I used to call it. Conkeldur is the real name. I am terrible at pulling packs out of this box. I'm glad this isn't necessarily a thing I can do around me. Like, go to a card shop and just pull out some packs because man this would ooh, this would be awful two three energy all right two packs left can we get at least one more hit we got a cedra weeping bell we got an xp share cubone we got a ponyard a hound hour we got a shinx love that awesome so so artwork we got a gliger a reverse phalanx, and on the end, we've got a hollow age of slash this time. So it is another hit. Not terribly good, but it is a hit. Hollow. All right. Last pack for the first half of this booster box. Let's see. Let's see what we can do. Got to get at least one good hit starting off with. There is your code. We've pulled a lot of dud packs. Like I said, we should be getting some good stuff here in the next two videos. We got Swordward and Shieldbert, which is such a weird card. We got a Firo, Carnivine, awesome a Lickitung, love that one. We got a Horsey, a Mankey, we got Mawile, a another Fermantis, seriously, a Galarian Slowpoke, and our final pull for the first 12 packs is a hollow Santaconda. All right, there we go. There is uh, the first 12 packs. Nothing crazy whatsoever. Four hollows, Crobat, Embor, Aegislash, Santaconda. Nothing nobody has seen, hasn't seen before. And our two, I guess you could say major hits, Tapu Koko V and Victini V. Not bad. I mean, they are V hits. If this was a normal like box opening, I would be happy with just these two here. But this is only video number one. We still have 24 packs, two videos, full of pulls. Hopefully they're gonna be stacked full of pulls though. But alrighty guys, if you enjoyed this video, hit that like button. If you're new, subscribe and check out another video while you're at it. Don't forget to hit the little bell button, get notifications when more videos go up. And as always guys, thank you so much for the love and support. It is greatly appreciated. And I will talk to you all later. See you.